Hello everybody out there in YouTube land. So, the compressor, the electric motor for the compressor is just stopping and humming. So, we're going to kind of take it apart and check out the switch contact switch here on the centrifugal clutch. And hopefully, cleaning that up will get it all fixed. All right, I am back. So I have the back cover taken off and the belt, so there's no tension on it. We're going to spin it. Um, what I'm going after are the contacts right here. Right in there. Um, it's like a centrifugal clutch almost. Two-speed clutch. And when it starts to spin, this will push up that kind of metal spring there, kind of back and it'll push and it'll put it from high torque to low torque mode and what I'm thinking is it's stuck on low torque mode so I'm gonna get these two screws off and remove this and then we'll see what we get all right I got that off here it is as you can see it's a centrifugal clutch as it spins faster that two arms come apart and then that moves like that. And then that'll change how this works down here. But sometimes what'll happen is the contact points will get all corroded and it doesn't work. So I'm going to take this part off. There's two black screws. And then I'm going to clean up the contact points in there. And we'll go from there. All right, so I have that apart. Here it is. And what we're going to clean are these little contact points right here. Get my finger better so you can tell. As you can see, they're a little bit corroded in there. And what happens is it goes back and forth, and it's like a two-speed transmission. And then that controls how the motor spins. And I'm going to use a... Uh, Thing and blow this all out inside and we'll put it back together and we'll see if that solved the problem hopefully it did or it will so I'm gonna use some like 200 grit sandpaper get that cleaned up and we'll be right back all right I'm back so I'm gonna show you how this works here so as you can see the con we did fix it too by the way as you can see the contact point back there we turn it on and it flips like that and the contact switch goes in to lower torque mode and when you take it off you will see it switch once it gets down to the right RPM it will go into high torque mode very very cool so I'm going to get it all hooked back up here and I'm hoping that'll be the fix. So if you guys have any questions on how to fix a compressor electric motor that's just buzzing and won't spin, uh, in the comments below, let me know. Hit that like button and subscribe. It helps us out. I'll see you guys later.